So Sheffield United 2, West Brom 1. Albion have had worse score lines, have been on the receiving end of worse score lines this season, but ultimately that's the, the worst result of the season for the Baggies. And it's it's it all comes down to the fact that they're playing bottom of the table, Sheffield United, a team that they beat earlier this season, albeit uh, in fortuitous circumstances, some would say. And ultimately, they've been beaten here. It, was, it wasn't it uh, was necessarily a must-win game, although many fans will have labelled it that. But it certainly was a must-not-lose. And that's exactly what the Baggies have done. Uh, first half, it was, it was, I mean, something of a traditional Sam Allardyce performance, some would say. Kind of held Sheffield United at arm's length for the majority. They had, did have a couple chances, but nothing, you know, gilt edge, so to speak. And, and uh, the Baggies struck... With a with a really a really good goal, it was on it was on the counter. Callum Robinson, good work on that left hand side, forced a save from Aaron Ramsdale in goal. And uh, Newman and by Diagne could have could have tucked it home, but eventually it was Matt Phillips who who did manage to get Albion in the lead. And it looked as if that would be, you know, a, a great foothold for Albion to, to build upon and and hopefully get a big win. But it wasn't to be the case. Second half. Sheffield United came on really strong, certainly, so, certainly showed a lot of grit, a lot of determination and fight, and uh, they got their two goals, and ultimately Alan, Albion um, were left to rue, rue, rue the day, really. Uh, another defeat, um, and, and all of a sudden Sheffield United are right behind the magazine the table. I think it's one point now uh, just separating those two, but back the, the Blades certainly do have a bit of momentum on their side. They've picked up some good results recently, and that'll be a huge... You know, um, boost for them, but for Albion, it's complete opposite, isn't it? Uh, many were hoping that they'd get a result today, and then with the new faces, Ainsley Maitland, Niles, one of them, um, and a couple more, that 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 it would give them a lift, and then hopefully they could get some results and and fire them towards survival. Those hopes of survival now are ever decreasing, uh, because if you're not going to beat bottom of the table, who will you be beating? And frankly, the second half wasn't really good enough, was it? I mean. A lot of the time, the Blades were holding Albion back. They weren't really managing to to build up um, and and really and really force any kind of any kind of chances. Really, they, they did have one, which Robinson, you know, forced a good save from Ramsdale. It was it was a great ball in, uh, but you know, when when you look at the replays, you, you're pretty certain that VAR is gonna gonna eventually rule that one out for offside, regardless. And it's just it's not really enough. And the the question marks. You know, and now and now on this side, can can the new signings lift this team again? Because all, at the moment, it doesn't look as though the Baggies are, are, are going to be picking up wins. And you know, they've had two games over this this week or so. Uh, Fulham, where um, you know they drew that one, and and then and then of course this one. And, and many fans would have said six points or, or four points at the minimum. And when you're only getting one from those two games, you do wonder where the points are going to come from. A uh, big task for Sam Allardyce. He's, he's he's kind of played all his cards now. Well, well, what cards he could play in the transfer market. He's stuck with this squad, uh, and he's got to try and get a, ri a rhythm out of them really, and and hopefully pick up some results. But now it's it's getting to the point where performances um, don't matter a whole lot. But it's always it's always down to the results, and at the moment they're just simply not going Albion's way. Uh, so a disappointing night for the Baggies at Bramall Lane. Uh, question marks all around. Can they lift themselves again? We will see. Um, but for now, things are looking bleak.